with the mayor? Yeah, we didn't give the picture with the Pope. All right, we're back on the morning brew with friends, and we have these awesome things here on the table. And I love this. This is Savetio and Kathy. You are with Correct. the uh, Italian festivals of New Mexico. Correct. And this is cool because I think a lot of us hear about bocce ball, mm -hmm. but you guys are actually going to be giving not not just classes, but even a tournament for bocce ball. Right. I right. love this. When is all of this happening? Well, the tournament's going to take place April the 18th and 19th, and that's going to be at Haynes Park in Rio Rancho. Mm -hmm. And we're playing two-man teams, and Saverio has all the he he kind of put together all of the rules for the tournament. Excellent. Using uh, official rules from the U.S. Bocce Federation. There's a federation for bocce. Yes. Absolutely. Are there professionals? Yes. Oh, absolutely. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, are you are you a professional or are you just a big no, fan? No, no, I'm a big fan. I'm an amateur, but you know, I'm uh, I'm a coach, but not for for bocce. But bocce is very very important in the history for, for Italy, and we are promoting bocce here in Albuquerque. Mm -hmm. the where, where are you from in Italy? I am from Roma. Oh, okay. I was born in Rome and raised there, and I moved here many years ago. And you work for Eclipse now. Yes, I um, work cool. for Eclipse Aerospace here. Making airplanes. airplanes. Making airplanes. <laughs> That's very cool. Albuquerque flying all over the world. That's great. And with the bocce, these are the bocce balls here. And how, how did you get involved? I mean, what what... Why is it fun, you think, to play bocce? I mean, I played it, I loved it. I got a chance to spend some time in Italy myself, and there is something awesome about it. But how did you guys get get involved? Yeah, well, I, I grew up with bocce in Italy, and basically, you know, everybody, when you are just a little child, up to the senior people to play bocce. They play bocce at the beach, they play bocce at the senior place where uh, there's a lot of tournaments. So everybody's really accustomed. Also, is this very... Simple, you know, a bocce basically is a ball. These are the official one, mm -hmm. so it's a couple of pounds and four inches of diameter used for the tournament, for the official tournament. But the, in the history, basically, they found that bocce was playing 7,000 years before Christ. So it's something very ancient. So 9,000 years whole, ago, at yeah, least. Yeah. It, was, it is one of the oldest sports in the world. Okay, and he was playing in, in Greece, he was playing the, in Rome, and the, the father of the medicine. Mm. Hippocrates, he was mm. playing bocce, recommending, you know, and so there's cool. a kind of tradition. Well, I think it's one of those games that everybody can play. It just takes a lot of time to master. Yes. Is that right? Yes. Cause so how does it work? For those, for those that don't really know, these are the bocce balls, and they're actually pretty heavy. These things are, are good sized, and they, they're pretty heavy. Then there's one little white one that's about half the size of a cue ball for a pool table. Yes. It's and right. how do you, how, so... Quickly, how do we play? So wh when we play, basically, what we need to do is just to make the, the big bocce coming as close as possible to the little one, which is called palino or boccino, okay? Every time that one of the bocce is really close, you get a point. Mm -hmm. So you can have basically maximum of four points. A game, a full game normally is played up to 12 points and sometimes to 15 points if it's a final. Okay. And the idea is to just throw this one at that one. Yes. But what it, that does is it sends that one down the road. Yes. So there's a lot of <laughs> physics here behind where there's the heating of the bocce. But when you play bocce, there's two main differences how to shoot the ball. One is called accostata. So it's, it's this little caress that you're going to do just with that. the bocce, yes. And you're trying just to put as close as you can do. And the best is called biberon. Biberon is when and basically is going so close that you are basically giving a little kiss to the bocino, okay? Now, the opponent, what he's trying to do, he wants to remove this from close to the bocino, and he's trying to do what is called bochatas, which is this kind of shooting that is going to really to hit very hard. And this can be done in two ways. One way is called rafa. Rafa is when basically you're going to do below, very close to the ground. Mm -hmm. Or you can do at volo. And volo is something when you're actually let flying, which is more difficult. Okay, that's... What's the, what do you call it when you just do one of those? One of those probably is that when you really, you know, Try to play baseball, but with this is just dangerous. You know? <laughs> oh, we're losing one here. They are. They, they do roll. Yeah. Yes. Uh, and the idea is that you, you, when I was in Italy, we, when we played this, you would play it down the alleyways. Yes. And you keep hitting a little bocino all the way down the alley, and then you chase it back and forth, right? Yes. And it becomes this game that you can play for hours. 
But with the tournament, I'm assuming it doesn't last for hours, no, right? No, no, we, we don't have that much time. <laughs> <laughs> and you get tired. The tournament is, like we said, it's going to be over a two-day period. Mm -hmm. And so it'll start on Saturday. And we have, similar to how World Cup is run, they have groups of four. Mm -hmm. uh, every team will play every other team in their group. Mm -hmm. And then the top two teams will advance to the finals. Mm -hmm. And two, uh, the other two teams with the highest score in the will advance. And so um, it's first to four, right? Or is it first to 12? To 12. Um, first to 12. Yes. yes. Right, right. And you have to win. It's either 12 or you win by two points mm -hmm. in the tournament. And so the average game takes about 30 minutes to play. So Very cool. uh, there's so a lot of games to be played. In how, many, preliminary. how many? Will you guys have the bocce balls available? We don't have to bring our own stats, right? No, no. We, we'll use this, yes. We okay. have purchased new balls, just like baseball. You don't want to use old balls, or you don't want to use Saverio's balls because he knows how to play, you know, with... Yeah. Uh, th there's a little bit of variance in the it, weight and the size, and so you yeah. have to... And everybody doesn't bring their own balls. We have the official... You have tournament balls. size. Yeah, these are yes. the house balls we provide. Got to make sure they're inflated to, to the right PSI, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right, right. <laughs> no, they're the, not inflatable. They're, they're solid. <laughs> and how many people on the team? We're playing the two-man teams. Two-man teams. Yeah. And then where can we figure out a little bit more to register? And uh, Well, you can go to our website, mm -hmm. italianfilmfest.org. And it is part of the film festival and really a this, whole week of Italian-American stuff, right? right? Well, <laughs> last year fun. when we did the first tournament, we did it during the film festival, but mm -hmm. we found a lot of people... Would, it was played indoors, and mm -hmm. a lot of people would have preferred to be outdoors. Plus, mm -hmm. you had to choose, like, are we going to go to the movies, are we are going to play bocce? And right. if you want to do both, it's kind of hard. So we right. decided to move it into April and do it at a later date after the film festival. And then we can be outdoors, it would be wonderful. Right. Out in Rio Rancho, big park, we can play all day, right? Oh, right, yes. absolutely. That would be great yeah. fun. Why don't you just throw one of those for us to show us how you, what's a, how does a pro roll one, Savetio? <laughs> okay, sure. <laughs> Just quickly. Very quickly. But basically, what we do here is just having... Um, well, just... Let me see this oh, guy. We'll put this right here. Okay. And then just... Let's see. What do we do? Something yeah. like that? Exactly. Exactly. That's perfect. <laughs> Excellent. That's perfect. All right. Thank you. Appreciate it. We'll see you guys at the tournament.